All right. We got PRS, Private Stock Guitar of the Month <laughs> for September. Look at that case. Very nice case. The first case I've seen with this particular old grandmother's couch motif. I think it's more of a Louis the Fourteenth robe case. Oh, from Versailles. Yeah. From Carlos Versailles. Carlos Versailles. Yeah. <laughs> Pop it open. Are, are you ready? Are you ready? Bam! So there we go. Private stock. Tire of the month. She's gold. Gold foil. Gold leaf. 23 gold leaf. carat. Gold leaf. Well, yeah. this is a really unique set of specs. This is a single cut with the shorter scale, 24 frets, with the trim. Well, is... Let's chop them up differently. So it's a single cut body and the thick single cut body. Right, right. Control. Right? Uh, and it also has the single cut knob and control layout. So like a Les Paul neck pickup volume tone, bridge pickup volume tone. Three-way switch up on the top horn. Uh, and it's got two humbuckers, which leads us into the Santana-isms. In that, it's got a trim, like a Santana. Lockers, too. Locking trim, like a San like the like what Carlos is using on tour now. Um, nice. 24 fret fingerboard, as Santana's always had. The 24 and a half inch scale is common to the single cut in the first place. Um, yeah. This is cool. Let's give it a... Give it a listen. Sit back for a sec. Beautiful. Hand signed. Hand signed by Mr. Santana. Private stock number 6443. Numbered as 1 out of 20. Guitar of the month. Signed by Paul Reed Smith and Paul Miles and Carlos on the back plate. Nice ribbon mahogany back. Nice figured mahogany neck too. Very, yeah, very nice. Cool. Just initial impressions holding it. Um, the neck shape on this guitar is great. Is it different? Uh, yeah, it's it's different to me in that it's very thick in the middle, but it has very very slim shoulders. V? Uh, like an old burst neck. Cool. Uh, we've had a couple of old bursts in the shop, so we're not talking out of our butts. We've held a couple of them here, and the old, yeah, the old Les Paul necks that we've come into contact with of 1959 Les Pauls, anyways, are kind of like this. They're a lot more V-shaped than you expect them to be. They're thick in the center, but very very contoured on the shoulders, and that's exactly what this feels like, which is really cool. So this is a copy of a guitar that he used at some recent show or some tour or something, right? Yeah. Okay. Is this what he was playing the anthem with at that basketball game? <clears throat> no, was definitely that? not. No. I think uh, he did a reunion with Neil Sean and stuff. I think he was playing these. We often Google pictures of Carlos Santana live to figure out what private stock specs we want because usually what Carlos actually plays, if we build it in private stock, will sell to a Santana fan. And we came across a picture of this guitar. Uh, and then it was announced as a guitar of the month shortly after. So they decided to produce it. Let's uh, let's give it a listen clean. So we're in the neck pickup here. Uh, Boogie Mark 525, single 12 cabinet with a V30. Everything set kind of flat. Still on standby. <laughs> <laughs> since they came out with a pickup. It just seems as the years pass, he's going for lower and lower output pickups. These are pretty detailed and vintage-y. Not as thick sounding as previous Santana guitars have had in them. Uh, retains your pick attack and nice string-to-string -string clarity. 